We're all connected to each other biologically, to the earth chemically, to the rest of the universe atomically. I think nature's imagination is so much greater than man's, he's never gonna let us relax, 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 relax. We live in an in-between universe where things change all right, but according to patterns, rules, or as we call them, laws of nature. I'm this guy standing on a planet. Really, I'm just a speck. I'm just a speck compared with a star. The planet is just another speck. To think about all of this. To think about the vast emptiness of space. There's billions and billions of stars. Billions and billions of specks. The beauty of a living thing is not the atoms that go into it, but the way those atoms are put together. is also within us. We're made of star stuff. We are away from the cosmos and know itself. Across the sea of space, the stars are other sun. We have traveled this way before, and there is much to be learned. We're all connected to each other biologically, to the Earth chemically to the rest of the universe atomic. I find it elevating and exhilarating to discover that we live in a universe which permits the evolution of molecular machines as intricate and subtle as we. I know that the molecules in my body are traceable to phenomena in the cosmos that makes me want to grab people in the street and say, have you heard this? The beauty of a living thing is not the atoms that go into it, but the way those atoms are put together. The cosmos is also within us. We're made of star stuff. We are away from the cosmos to know itself. There's this tremendous mass of waves all over in space, which is the light bouncing around the room, going from one thing to the other, and it's all really there, really, really there. But you gotta stop and think about it, about the complexity, and really get the pleasure. It's all really there, really, really there. The inconceivable nature of nature. To think about all of this, to think about the vast emptiness of space. There's billions and billions of stars, billions and billions of specks. The beauty of a living thing is not the atoms that go into it, but the way those atoms are put together. The cosmos is also within us. We're made of star stuff. We are away from the cosmos. To know itself. Across the sea of space, the stars are other sun. We have traveled this way before, and there is much to be learned.